that's as good a safety shot as you'll see. Had to make a thin contact, otherwise he would have went into the jaws of the corner pocket. And he avoided the brown also. Is this a double? Attempted it, but he hasn't got a good white. Might just be okay. It's a thin snick that Ronnie's looking at into the middle pocket. Might be able to cut it in. Very, very awkward though. Pink now tied up, black way up the other end of the table, almost straight on this red. Eight. <coughs> Could do with the black back on the spot in a few shots time. Can't attempt it from here because there's no way I can get on a red, it's the blue that'll get in position. I was very, very impressed with Ronnie O'Sullivan's focus and his match against Ken Doherty. A couple of very tactical frames, but he was very patient. Fourteen. And of course, the most impressive thing of all in that performance was that uh, at five all, he made a superb century in the decider and made it, as Doherty remarked, so nonchalantly. 19. He'd still try and get on the blue here because if he gets a good angle he can then go into the pink and reds. A slightly more difficult pot is the better shot to get position. Now how's the pace on the white? 20. <laughs> There's still a red available to the left and the back of the bunch. It's the one he's played for. And now when playing the next shot, he could develop the pink and reds, but he's got to make sure 25. he gets a good white. That's a pretty 26. good white. Yes, and didn't get there by chance either. I think that uh, O'Sullivan is so good with these shots off and through the bunch. Depending on the angle he has here, might even be able to get onto the black. It doesn't have to. Well, he's, he must have missed hit that because look, look, look where the white's finished. <coughs> he could quite easily have dropped in behind the black and it would have been a pretty straightforward black. He played for the blue and he's just hit it far too hard. That red potted freed the other three reds, as you could see with that previous One. shot, into the right corner. Well, I think Stephen's going to have to take the black on now. There's the three reds all waiting to be potted. Stephen. 
Maguire won. Well, that was a chance for Maguire to get a promising counter-attack going. But uh, at least he's not left an easy starter for O'Sullivan or any starter at all. He can't afford to do that, and you can see he's a bit annoyed there. OK, he hasn't left Ronnie in, but he must take those sort of chances. And Cannon on the blue has given him another chance here. Is he going to fully commit and try and pop this and get on the pink? He would have done, but the blue's in the way. He's leaning over the table. It's a bit awkward. And that's the reason he's refusing that pot into the right corner, the one that's closest to the cue ball. That was much more difficult. And I think he may have stuck this red up. Is there a path past the brown? Yeah, I just mentioned earlier, Clive, I think <coughs> Stephen's got to get off to a good start or get in and knock a sizable break in to give him the confidence with this new cue that he's using. One. Sullivan, 44 in front. Eight. And enough easily potable reds to secure the frame at this visit. Nine. Might as well use your left hand, Ronnie is so good with it, rather than stretch. Twenty-two. Twenty-three. Uh, Sullivan missed a very easy ball when he had his first clear-cut chance on 31. But uh, assured of clinching the opening frame. Thirty. From his second chance now. Yeah, I just 31. sense he's in the mood. Uh, he's up for this. And... He's going to take a bit of stopping here this evening. Stephen Maguire is going to have to really up his game to have any chance against a Ronnie O'Sullivan in this form. And I'm sure Stephen knows that only too well. 39. I think O'Sullivan's been in the mood all week. personality he is 44 an enigma at times what about this for a shot five <laughs> well even with the frame in the bag that was such a good pot that was the pot of the week 49 51 54. O'Sullivan's confidence has every reason to be sky high. Maguire has missed a couple. And uh, his level of confidence 58. is more questionable. 
So let's have a look at pot of the week. He didn't have to worry about leaving it because the frame was in the bag. But what a shot this was. And Hawk, I'll show you exactly. I mean, look at the angle that is. And he's going down into a very narrow pocket. OK, if you're in behind the red. But it really was, uh, well, you, you, just, you just don't come any better than this. Yeah, it just shows how he recognises the potting angle, even when it's unusual. That's years of practice, and you know the angles, and he's left the arena. I still think he's got that head cold, uh, Clive, but I think I mentioned in the last match, when I used to play, sometimes I played some of my best snooker when I had a cold or a touch of the flu, because you concentrated more. I've opened that one. You were two in that, you? I mentioned that new cue that okay. Stephen has. He's playing brilliantly and practice with it, but it's a confidence thing and a psychological thing. And if you miss a few long pots, it can cause a few doubts. 